So let's try in three, two, one. kind of tastes all right kind of tastes like the blue Gatorade flavor though not much raspberry flavor in it it's flavored fruit drink so honestly guys I'm gonna give this a 7 out of 10 because like I said it tastes kind of like blue Gatorade not much ras not much raspberry flavor into it I also think it tastes like pear which I didn't really taste anything so honestly yeah that's my opinion on it the rating is what's up guys here it's spencer from spencer's food reviews here tonight i'm here with another review i'm here with another video it's been a while since now been a couple weeks since i did an upload other than the live stream last time i've actually made a video was when i was in missouri and doing that Mountain Dew Flaming Hot Chug, so I apologize for the inconvenience for not uploading for th within a few days. So honestly, let's get to the review and and look tonight. So this is we're doing a Papa Murphy's review. We're doing the Papa Murphy's pepperoni and sausage family sized with extra cheese. And honestly, I want to give my opinions on this. So what I honestly think of this is kind of looks gross in my opinion it just doesn't look so good so honestly guys let's give it a try guys I honestly do not like it a whole lot it just I feel like puking though it just tasted that bad it just did not sit well with my stomach at all and uh, it just tasted pretty yicky it didn't taste like any other normal pizza would. And this, I'm not trying the sausage because it just honestly looks disgusting. It doesn't look like, I don't know, it kind of, yeah, it just looks like, it just looks gross. The cheese tasted pretty, it was off. It just, Felt like I was eating something really disgusting. Honestly, a scale the scale out of ten would be a two out of ten. The taste wasn't very good. It had no the texture in this honestly looks like puke. That it just might be me or that or it just yeah, it just looks like somebody puked and I just it just it looked I knew it was going to be terrible the moment I looked at this, and I knew I wasn't going to enjoy it. It just, and when I tasted it, it almost made me, I almost felt like puking, though. It just how bad that tasted, honestly. The sausage, I don't even want to get into it. The pepperoni was just awful. It almost tastes like Spam, if you know what that is, it was just bad. I'm not really a Papa Murphy's, huge Papa Murphy's guy, but I should have seen this coming when 
I was going to review this, so honestly, let me know what you guys think in the comments. It just, I just don't like how they made it at all. The texture is, you see how it kind of, why I say it looks like someone puked? Just look at the texture. Cheese, I know there's like mozzarella cheese and all that other stuff. But, truly, I'm not really much of a sausage guy either, but pepperoni sits well with me. I like pepperoni, but, you know, not, this is, this wasn't a very good pizza in my opinions in my books. Two out of ten. You guys didn't do too well on this one. So, honestly, yeah, two out of ten. So let me know what you guys think of the pepperoni of this pizza. Let me know if you guys have tried it before. It just, I recommend you guys not having this because it would just taste it bad. It doesn't, it doesn't sit well with my stomach, like I said earlier. So honestly, let me know what you guys think in the comments. Like, comment, and subscribe. And by the way, before the end of this video, I want you guys to promote my channel everywhere. I want to be big on YouTube one, one day. I want to be making videos with my favorite YouTubers and all that. So honestly, yeah, thank you guys for subbing and watching. Like, comment, and subscribe. And be, stay tuned for a live stream tonight. So what's going on YouTubers here? It's Spencer from Spencer's Food Reviews here. Today we're going to be doing another video. So we're going to be doing the Mellow Yellow review. So I never had Mellow Yellow. And so it's citrus flavored soda. So yeah, let's try it. So it's kind of, I think it's kind of like Mountain Dew where it's citrus flavored. Mountain Dew is also citrus flavored, so honestly guys, less than, yep, let's give it a try. Honestly guys, it kind of, it tastes really just like Mountain Dew, and, and a little bit of Sprite as well, so. Honestly, I don't really think it's alright, just it tasting a whole lot like Mountain Dew. So, honestly, on a scale, I think it's a 3 out of 10, because it's a Mountain Dew ripoff. I think Mountain Dew's a lot better than this. This is just the exact same like Mountain Dew, so honestly guys, let me know what you guys think in the comments, because I don't really like anything that's the exact same as the other product, as another product, and I think this is the same as Mountain Dew, so honestly guys, 3 out of 10, so let me know what you guys think in the comments section, like, comment and subscribe and thank you guys for watching so what's going on youtubers here it's spencer from spencer's food reviews here today and we're going to do another video we're going to be doing the root beer comparison between mugs root beer and teddy's root beer so yeah so what we're going to do first is we're going to try Mugs. So yeah, let's open it up. What I like about the Mugs root beer is, is that it has a more cleaner vanilla taste into it. It has that good vanilla taste into it. So, yeah. And it also has a pretty strong vanilla taste in it too. Creamy and stuff. So honestly guys, now let's try Teddy's root beer. And they're both caffeine free too, so honestly, yeah.
Teddy's also has that really creamy and strong vanilla taste into it, but not as good as, but not as clean as Mug, so what I think is better is, is Mug. Mug is better than Teddy's, but I think, I also think that Teddy's is pretty good too, so, but usually it tastes a lot better when Teddy's is cold. Teddy's is better when cold, because it's not as good when it's warm, so. So I think that Mug <laughs> is the better root beer here. So let me know what you guys think in the comments. Like, comment, and subscribe. Let's open it up. Oh, that smells good. That smells so good. Yeah. It's, yeah, I don't know. The taste is, is not the best in this, but... Pepper in it. It just, for whatever reason, it just kind of tastes a little weird. So you can try it. Yeah. Okay. Here we go. <laughs> Spencer, what did you give me? I don't what know. is that? I don't know. Are you all right? You all right? <laughs> no. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Spencer, what is this? I don't know. What kind of place is this? I just tried the Dr. Pepper Berry. That it's just right, it's just a new Dr. Pepper flavor. <laughs> so, what's your opinion on it, Bob Figglebottom? Really? <laughs> what's your opinion? Uh, you didn't say you didn't like it. Oh no, I thought it was pretty good. That is pretty good. I just thought it was mid. So I'm going to rate this a 6 out of 10 because it just tasted weird. So let me know what you guys think in the comments. Like, comment, and subscribe. Is it good? Yeah. Okay, what's up, uh, what's up, YouTubers? This is Spencer from the Spencer's Food Review Search tonight. I'm at a Team Knit Monkey Team Navy night. So, and I'm here to review this awesome burger right here, the Monkey Burger. Anyways, so, let's give it a try. It's a 11 out of 10. This burger is absolutely tremendous. It's a tremendous night for for the softball team naming night. So my opinion is on this 11 out of 10. The meat in this was really good. So let me know what you guys think of the monkey burger in the comments. Like, comment, and subscribe. What's up guys here? It's Spencer from Spencer's Food Reviews here tonight. I'm going to be doing another video. So I'm going to be doing a pizza review. And I haven't uploaded in a week, I think. But back to an actual food review here. So this is Robert's Pizza here. And this is what, and we're going to review their cheese pizza. So this is what it looks like. The cheese, honestly, I like the smell of the pizza though. And actually, I just like the smell of it. And this is the back of it. Doesn't really matter. But, and this is what the crust looks like. So... Honestly, yeah, looks pretty good. So let's give it a try. Good pizza right here, guys. This is very good and 
absolutely tremendous pizza right here. Nothing goes wrong with it. There's actually, in my opinion, nothing wrong with the taste here. And the cheese actually tasted good. Sauce tasted good. So, on a scale rating, I'm going to give this a 10 out of 10. This was actually was good pizza. And you know, the best thing about this pizza is, it's not overcooked or anything. Pizza's better when it looks a lot better when it's not even slightly a bit overcooked. Uh, yeah. So honestly, yeah. And let's get a, let's talk about the taste a little bit. So the cheese, honestly, I don't know what this is, but yeah. The cheese had that flavor into it, had that more. I don't know what to describe it though. Just had that real good flavor to it. So did the sauce. And I would have, I mean, honestly, the crust looks a little overcooked. Not overcooked, but it looks hard. So. tastes good there. It doesn't taste dry or anything. The crust just tastes just tastes good. It tastes it might be a little hard though, but it doesn't have that dry taste into it. So honestly, let me know let me know what you guys think in the comments of this pizza. So like, comment, and subscribe. So thank y'all for watching my channel. I just reached 50,000 views the other day. And now let's hope let's get to a million views by the end of this this year with a thousand subs. So like, comment, and subscribe and share. Thank you.